Anyway, so it is the first day of class and I... What? I promise. What's up guys? Welcome to the Pink Desert. My name is Addy and today I'm joined with my boyfriend Julian because today is our three year anniversary and we just got back from dinner. We picked up some boba and we decided to tell you guys the story of how we met. Oh. Cheers. So I was a freshman in college and I remember it was like the beginning of 2018. It was a brand new year. I had just gotten out of a relationship. So my mindset was like, you know, just focus on myself, no boyfriends. No, but what I'm trying to say is that I was literally not looking for anyone. Anyway, there was like a, only like 10 kids in our class. It was such a like small class. So finally the teacher closes the door because it's time like for class to start and he starts talking about the class he like starts even taking attendance and then this boy <laughs> knocks while well, i hear an, a door like you know someone knocking and i look and the teacher opens the door and it's you guys could probably tell um and i swear like i still remember i looked at the door and i was like oh my gosh he's so cute watch him sit next to me like I remember I told myself, I still remember like perfectly, I just told myself that. Like I was like, oh my gosh, he's so cute. Watch him sit next to me. By the way, there was a seat next to me that was empty. Um, by the time like the teacher closed the doors, I was like, yes. And then like he came in and I was like, oh my gosh, he's gonna sit next to me. After he like sits next to me, I'm like freaking out. Cause I'm like, what the heck? Like, what do I do? Like I need to talk to him. And Julian literally has his headphones in. Like he doesn't care <laughs> about anything in the world. And yeah, like the teacher just like kept talking, whatever. And I was just like trying to find a way to talk to him. Um, so I think I, I don't even remember exactly what I told you, but I was just like, you didn't tell me anything. I didn't. No. So we had like lecture, and then at a certain time we had to like move into another classroom where it was like basically a computer lab with a bunch of Macs and editing software. Um, so he's like, okay guys, so let's go ahead and pack up our things and go to this lab. And it was literally like right next door, literally like a step away. And so when he's like, okay guys, like let's pack up. I remember thinking like, I need to pack slow enough to like, you know, go behind him. And then, but not like too slow. So anyways, I, he gets up and I'm like, okay, I need to like go. And then he like goes into the classroom and <laughs> he like sits and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna sit literally right next to him. And that's exactly what I did. And this is when we started like slowly talking. Like I was just like, oh, hey. And I remember you took out your headphone. You were like, oh, what? Like you were still here. <laughs> <laughs> and so this is when we like started talking like very, very small talk, like just like, oh, hey. And it was like this big like computer lab, like with 30 computers. And he sat in the corner. <laughs> And I literally sat right next to him. Like no one else was near us. Literally it was just us two. Class like continued. And I remember the teacher, he would always tell us like, are you guys related? Are you guys brother and sister? And I remember I was like, oh my gosh. Like I would just look at him and like blush. And Julian was like, no, like, you know? <laughs> and I was just like freaking out that he was telling us these things, you know? Oh, we started like, walking out of class together because we sat next to each other that we were just like, you know, walking out at the same pace. And I don't know, I feel like you kind of liked me too. No. Anyways. Maybe I was just friendly. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> You're probably just like friendly. So I used to work at a fast food place. What's crazy about this whole thing, I guess, I don't know. My coworker, um, his name is Dom, which actually turned out to be his literal best friend since like middle school, right? So it was just crazy. I don't even know. I don't even remember like how we or how I found out that Dom was his best friend and he was also my coworker. But I do remember like the first days that I really liked Julian. Um, I was just talking about. I guess I was talking about him in, at work or maybe not. I don't know. But I remember I just asked Dom like, "Hey, like, can I ask you a question?" And he's like, "Is it about Julian?" And I was like, "No." And he's like, "You like him, huh?" And I was like. Mm, like I don't know and then he's like yeah he's not looking for a girlfriend <laughs> it literally went 
in through one ear and out the other because like when I really like something I really like go get it but yeah once we started like really talking a little bit more like slowly um, we found out that we went to the same high school so we were like we pretty much live in the same like area which is nice and then also we found out that well I guess he told me that he was in band all four years I was a cheerleader all four years and when he was a senior I was a junior we were both like cheering or <laughs> So we were both basically at like football games, like Friday night football games. I was dancing to like the band music. Yeah, we basically like were around each other, but not really, we didn't know each other. So it was just like crazy. And then we started, oh, it was probably like the beginning because when you started to DM me on Instagram, because yes, because you asked me what book we needed. You were like, what edition is it? Like if you care. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. You asked me. I remember you asked me. He asked me for my number. We started talking or like through text rather than DMs. And that's when we started like planning out because you. I remember you were... Yes, you messaged me first because you were like, let's hang out. We should hang out more. No, that was you. No. And then I asked you for the book. We started planning out like our first date. Well, I guess we just wanted to hang out, but then we were like, okay, let's just go on a date or whatever. You know, like it's just us. No, I remember I asked you. At the end of it, I was like, I want to ask you something, but I don't know if it's, if it's weird. And you were like, what? Like, you wouldn't leave my car? And then I was like, was this a date? <laughs> and you were like, uh, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, so yeah, we were pretty much just like planning to hang out. We were going to go eat, and it was just us two, so it was technically a date. Um, and yeah, we pretty much planned that out. And then the first, or actually right before our first date, we hung out like super spontaneously, like super last minute. I was like, hey, like I just took some pictures. I want to show somebody, like, can I show you? <laughs> and then that night we pretty much hung out. We like just talked inside the car for like, I don't know, we were up late. And then like, <laughs> remember the cop like came with the light? He was like, get out the park, it's closed. And then after that, since we didn't want to like stop hanging out, we even went to Walmart. We were just like walking around. <laughs> after our first day, we pretty much like hung out like pretty often. I want to say every day. We just like came to this point, or at least me, because remember I was like, no boys for, I don't know. Um, and I remember we like had an issue where I was like, I didn't want to date him. Like I did because I liked him a lot, but I didn't want to like, date date just yet because I wanted to be best friends first and then like later like date it was weird because I would tell him like so when are you gonna kiss me and stuff like that <laughs> like I don't know I guess I was playing like hard to get I don't know but um after that like we had like this conversation this deep conversation late at night and he basically told me like dude it's fine like let's just date we're gonna be best friends anyways so let's just you know? So yeah, that's pretty much the story of how we met and here we are now dating for three years. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in my next video. Bye!